Rich Melendez here. I want to give you a quick minute on agency. I want to speak to you about the scope of authority. I want to speak to you about apparent authority, which is different than actual authority. Apparent authority is based on the principal's conduct that has conveyed to a third party the appearance of the agent's authority to act. This occurs in two situations. Either the principal has clothed the agent with an indicia of authority that the third party has relied upon, or the principal has knowingly permitted an agent to hold himself or herself out as having authority. The ultimate question is, would the conduct of the principal lead a reasonably prudent person to believe that the agent had authority to act these can be complex cases. Speak to an attorney. Thank you and good luck with your case.